Hey everybody, just wanted to show you a demo here of how I've been using the Amazon Echo. $179 on Amazon.com and I've had it for about a week now and uh, I like it a lot, very impressed with everything it can do. So, there you have the Amazon Echo. It's a cylindrical shaped speaker and you set it up once you connect it to your home Wi-Fi network through the uh, Amazon, I think it's called the Alexa app on your smartphone and it allows you to start using it and doing uh, different things. So I think what's great about this, everybody will find something that they can use it for. So I'm going to show you a couple things here. Uh, in this case, I have Philips Hue bulbs in the kitchen and in other parts of my home. And I place the Amazon Echo in a central location and surprisingly I'm able to hear it from other places, uh, other corners of my place here. So those are all Hue lights and I've set it up so that I can uh, control them uh, either individually or by grouping them into different rooms. So I'll show you a couple of things here. Notice how when I activate the device by using the keyword, you'll see the ring light up and it'll turn green uh, depending on which direction it detected the sound. So that, that's pretty cool. Little touch there. Alexa, set a three minute timer. Your timer will ring three minutes from now. Alexa, turn off all the lights. All right, so there you okay. go turned off all of the lights as you can see as I pan around and we're gonna go turn them on section by section so here we go Alexa turn on the kitchen lights okay right there so those are on Alexa turn on office lights I found several devices matching that name which one did you need all right, so you have to remember how you named it. So instead of office lights, I forgot that it's actually work lights. So Alexa, Sorry. Alexa, turn on work lights. Okay. There you go, turns on those. Alexa, turn on living room lights. There you go okay. with that. Alexa, turn on bedroom lights. So that's very cool. That works from anywhere in my home I, uh, because I placed it in a central location. It's uh, quite impressive how far away it can pick up your voice. So very cool for uh, lighting control. One of the things, uh, one of the many things you can do with it. You can play music too, ask for the weather, all kinds of things. Uh, if you're a Prime member, uh, pretty much uh, anything from Prime Music. I don't even know what they have, but I'll just ask it to play anything like Alexa, play classical music. Classical, focus on prime music. So there you go, it starts playing music. I can turn the volume up or down. Alexa, volume seven. Alexa, volume two. All right, so you can barely hear that. I'll stop it. Alexa, stop. So it hears you very well, it understands very well. Uh, I'm gonna say at this point, it's probably better than Siri and Google Now. Uh, not by far, but definitely uh, a little better. Uh, the way it understands and how it can pick up your voice and all the things it can do. The app has some skills that people, developers are using to add more functionality. Here are some of the things that uh, you can ask it. That it has on the box. I mainly use it for timers, music, asking it for the weather. There's a news briefing option that it's good in the mornings when I'm uh, preparing breakfast. I can uh, stay current with that. And I'm going to show you here on the Nest using Ift, I can have it control the Nest as well. Although right now I just have it for one temperature. So there it's, uh, you're hearing the alarm for the three minute timer I set before, if you heard that noise. Alexa! Stop. 
So right now my nest is set for 81 and I've programmed it through IFT when I trigger it through Alexa. For now, it'll just automatically, there's only one uh, temperature setting that it'll do. It'll go to 70, I think it's 76. So let's uh, see what that looks like. Alexa, trigger nest. There you go. So just changed it to 78, which is what I had set up on IFT for the Nest app. So or I think uh, everybody will find something else that they want to control with it. But for now, the lights and I'm going to work on, you can program more commands on IFT and use that with Alexa. Uh, I could probably, there it turned on. Alexa, stop. And eventually, I want to set it up to control my entertainment center right here with the Harmony Hub. So that's uh, my next little project. I'll show you guys that. But that was a basic demonstration of Alexa and some of the things I use it for. And I'll turn off the lights to close the video here. Alexa. Actually, dim one. Dim, Alexa. Dim lights to 10%. So it dims all my lights to uh, 10%. It's a Philips Hue strip there and all these other lights. Alexa, dim lights to 100%. Alexa, turn off the lights. All right, that was it. Thanks for watching. Any questions, just drop a comment below. Thank you.